In modern football, it's important for players to put in the work away from the training pitch, as well as for clubs to invest in improving their players' strength and conditioning. But do you know exactly what the role of a fitness coach is? Let's find out with the help of Nick Harvey, the head of physical performance at BVF Football Academy. My name's uh, Nick Harvey. I'm from England. I've been here in Vietnam at PVF Academy and Phu Hien uh, Club in a role as kind of head of physical performance. So key roles would be working within within the coaching setup um, to make sure that the players are as, as well prepared physically as possible. We're very careful with the planning process. So myself, the head coach, and the coaching staff. Um, we'll sit down and we'll plan kind of the week's training in advance, obviously. So then on a daily basis, it's just kind of refining that plan. It would totally vary depending on the, on the day. So, uh, for example, yesterday we were in, in the gym doing some strength and power work before we then went out onto the pitch. So that would be my role to lead that session, kind of plan and deliver that work with the players. So that's trying to develop their strength and power, which is going to support their performance on the pitch. And then going into the session, uh, it might be a different type of kind of physical preparation. So uh, the warm-ups would usually focus on certain aspects. We want to really make sure we're preparing the players, not just for the average parts of that game, but for the hardest parts of the game. And we like to use the saying, we, we train hard, we fight easy. So we really want to push the players in training so they're ready for the game. So again, that would be my role to lead that with the support of the coaches. On the pitch, you know, you have to push players. They're human beings. There's some days where they're feeling a little bit low and, and, and not with as much energy and I think part of my role is to try and bring that energy and that enthusiasm every day to try and inspire the players and then yeah I guess there's a subjective side so we want to try and support the head coaches and the coaching staff to make sure um, we're giving them our expertise in terms of what the players need to do on the training pitch from a football perspective so it's building those relationships and trying to get that good collaboration between kind of all the departments so uh, coaches technical coaches physical coaches physiotherapists um, that's the goal for me, that's the secret of, of high performance. If we can get to that point where everyone's collaborating really efficiently, then we're, we're going to be supporting the players as best we can. I really enjoy it because I'm working with a fantastic group of people, and I think that's the key. But also, um, really fortunate to have met a, a, a really kind of young, dynamic, forward thinking, talented coach in, in Mauro Geronimo, who's, who's been great to work with. And certainly, so that's kind of similar to some of the relationships I had with coaches back in England, and that's so that's something that's been really, um, really helpful to my job. From that perspective, really enjoying it. Uh, my family has settled here in Vietnam, um, and it's been a great adventure so far. It's been a, you know, I feel very blessed to to be here and, and experience this this fantastic country, and um, hopefully, you know, the challenge will continue in, in the next few months.